Can a creature be considered mythological if someone has some proof of its existence? Can we consider the footage you're about to see concrete evidence of the existence of these creatures? Well, you tell us as we take a look at 10 mythical creatures caught on camera. Number one is what I think is the most compelling footage that we have, so stand by for that one. With all that said and done, let's begin, shall we? Number 10. The Boogeyman. The Boogeyman is a mythical monster whose impact can be traced around the world. One of the first references of this legendary creature was found in the 1500s, though it is suspected that the Boogeyman has existed for much longer than this. It is thought that the Boogeyman was originally a reference for mischievous creatures called Hobgoblins. Throughout much of Europe, Hobgoblins are actually quite friendly or limited to lighthearted pranks, but there are tales of Hobgoblins who were much viler in nature. These creatures were said to torment humans, sometimes at the point of frightening a person to death. The videos you see are what people claim to be proof of boogeymen. In one of these clips, one of then-President Obama's security detail was filmed while his face was morphing into something more demonic. Is the boogeyman real? What do you think? Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take five seconds to complete. So, here's the deal. He does leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button and hit the notification bell, and you will get 25 years of amazing luck. Try it, it really works. Number 9. The Yeti. The Yeti, once better known as the Abominable Snowman, is a mysterious bipedal creature said to live in the mountains of Asia. It sometimes leaves tracks in snow, but is also said to dwell below the Himalayan snow line. Despite dozens of expeditions into the remote mountain regions of Russia, China, and Nepal, the existence of the Yeti remains unproven. The Yeti is said to be muscular, covered with dark grayish or reddish brown hair, and weigh between 200 and 400 pounds. It is relatively short compared to North America's Bigfoot, averaging about 6 feet in height. Though this is the most common form, reported Yetis have come in a variety of shapes. Nepalese seem to have a firm belief of the existence of this creature. Furthermore, they say that they even have proof. In the video, we can see something Harry kept in a glass box. This box is kept in a small monastery in Nepal, and its keepers believe that this is the scalp of an actual Yeti. Many people travel long distances just to see this bizarre artifact. Whether it's real or not remains an unanswered question. Number 8. The Banshee. Banshees are believed by some to be the spirits of nature, or pre-Christian Gaelic deities. It is also said to be tasked with the job of warning selected members of ancient Irish families at the time of their death. According to tradition, the Banshee was only said to cry for four major families, but this list seems to have been extended due to marriage. Rarely seen but heard, her morning call is often given at night when someone is about to die. In 1437, Scottish King James I is said to have been approached by one such being. There have been numerous reports of the same thing happening to members of the royal court and other high-profile members of Irish society. The quality of her voice ranges from region to region. Some describe it as low and pleasant, which can be used to comfort people or generally just to make them feel good, and to others as a mix of a wail of a woman and a moan of an owl, which can hypnotize many. Some also take to singing songs to do the work and put power into it without changing the sound. Banshees also appear in places where there is great sorrow and pain. This clip claims to have captured the wail of a banshee. If you just listen for it, you can definitely hear it. What do you think? Is this the wail of a banshee, or is it something with a more non-paranormal explanation? Maybe it's something like that screaming goat from all those years ago. Number 7. The Pontianak. Often considered to be the most dangerous entity in Malay and Indonesian folklore, Patayanaks are said to be the spirits of women who died during childbirth, and are also known as vampiric ghosts. They are active at night, while during the day the Pontianak spirit resides inside banana trees. Pontianak locate their prey by sniffing clothes that are left out to dry, which is the reason Malays refuse to keep their clothes outside at night. They kill their victims by digging their sharp nails into the victim's stomach and devouring their organs. They are described to be pale-skinned with long hair and dressed in white. They also have long, sharp nails and have an awful stench. They usually announce their presence through baby cries. It's said if the cry is loud, she is far away, but it's soft, then she is nearby. Though it's also said that if you hear a dog wolf howl, then she is far away, but if it's whimpering, she is nearby. In this clip, we see a man exploring a heavily wooded area. While filming the thick woods, the man was able to capture footage of a woman with long black hair and wearing a long white dress. You decide for yourself if this is legitimate or not. Number 6. The Fire Dragon. 
The fire dragon is a mythological water reptile that is said to be found in West Virginia with a rather ironic name. This is somewhat of a local legend. Reports of the fire dragon go back to the 1920s when it was spotted by train conductors and even said to have attacked old steam engines. It is said to be 12 feet long and weigh 1,000 pounds, and is also said to be attracted to heat, hence the attack on steam engines. The video you are seeing is taken from the TV show Mountain Monsters, and it was footage shot by a witness named Bub. He says he recently encountered the fire dragon while he was camping. Late at night, Bub was about to cook some fish he caught over his campfire, when he heard noises in the bushes and caught a glimpse of a 12-foot-long creature, which stood up on two legs and headed for his fire. Bub then got on his quad and drove 20 yards away, then looked back and saw the creature thrashing about where the fire was, and then he drove away. I don't know about you, but the footage looks pretty CGI to me. Number 5. The Phoenix The story of the Phoenix is legendary and is likely one of the most well-known ancient myths in modern day. The legend is famous for the many elements it is said to concern. Life and death, creation and destruction, even time itself is tied with the tale of the Phoenix. There are many stories about the origin of the Phoenix, one for every culture it seems, but no matter what the culture, all stories seem to have some things in common. They all seem to agree that the Phoenix is reborn right after death, and is always depicted as a bird shrouded in fire. In this clip, which was said to be taken in the skies above Los Angeles, shows what seems to be an ordinary bird, just flying around. That is, until it suddenly bursts into flame. It continued to fly, seemingly unperturbed by the flames engulfing its body. This one looks much less CGI than the last one. Number 4. The Werewolf A werewolf, also known as a lycanthrop or wolfman, is a mythological or folkloric human with the ability to shapeshift into a wolf or a combination of wolf and man. Werewolves are said to be created after being placed under a curse or if bitten and scratched by another werewolf. It is said that they stay human most of the time, but undergo transformation with the appearance of the full moon. In addition to the natural characteristics inherent to both wolves and humans, werewolves are often attributed strength and speed far beyond those of wolves or men. The werewolf is generally held as a European character, although its lore spread through the world in later times. Shapeshifters similar to werewolves are common in tales from all over the world. The clip that you're about to see is claiming to be footage of an actual werewolf caught on security cameras. I don't know about you, but all I see is a dark bird that's moving pretty fast and kind of looks like a bear in all honesty. It can be any animal for all we know. Also, the fact that this video was uploaded without any backstory makes me doubt its authenticity. Number 3. Gnomes Gnomes are very widespread species, known to a number of human races. Believed to originate from Scandinavia, gnomes later migrated to the lowlands some 1500 years ago. Gnomes consist of a number of different types. The most common is the forest gnome who rarely comes into contact with man. The garden gnome lives in old gardens and enjoys telling melancholy tales. Dew gnomes are slightly larger than their woodland brethren and choose remarkably drab clothing. House gnomes have the most knowledge of man, often speaking his language. And when sightings of gnomes are reported, it's probably this type of gnome that is seen. In this footage, we can see what seems to be a typical garden gnome. You know, those tacky garden decorations made of plastic or plaster that look like tiny old men with hats. It looked pretty ordinary until it started to move and walk behind a bush. The footage is extremely shaky, so initially it's quite hard to see its movements, until again it walked behind a bush. And now it's time for the day's best pick. Today we're going to take a look at what claims to be footage of one of the most famous mythological creatures in the world. Find out what it is and decide for yourself whether the footage is real or not with number 2. The Pegasus In Greek mythology, Pegasus was an immortal winged horse, one of the two children of Poseidon and Medusa. Along with his brother, the golden-sworded Chryseor, Pegasus sprang forth most miraculously from his pregnant mother's neck after Perseus had beheaded her. He belonged to the Greek hero Bellophoron for some time, before being stabled by Zeus and tasked with drawing the chariot of his thunderbolts. Many legends surround this fabled horse. All of them could be read in Greek mythology books, so I won't be diving into that in this list. Rather, let's take a look at this video. This footage was said to be taken on November 23rd, 2014, in the skies above Mecca in Saudi Arabia. It was taken during a thunderstorm, and that's why it's so dark. In this video, a winged black horse is seen flying in the sky in plain sight of people, and they are clearly panicking. According to the poster, many people who witnessed the flying horse believe that it was a sign of the end times. 
Is this winged horse the fabled Pegasus, or is this just a hoax? Number 1. Goblins. A goblin is a monstrous creature known from European folklore, first attested in stories from the Middle Ages. They are ascribed various and conflicting abilities, temperaments, and appearances depending on the story and country of origin. They are almost always small and grotesque, mischievous or outright malicious, and greedy especially for gold and jewelry. They often have magical abilities similar to a fairy or demon. Sometimes they also like to fight Spider-Man as well. Okay, moving on from the terrible joke, in many cases they are minions of an evil overlord or live as tribes in the wild, attacking passing humans like bandits. These types of goblins may even be seen as pests to be exterminated. This footage has been on YouTube for years, although I couldn't find when exactly it was first uploaded. In this clip, a mom was taking a video of her son while playing on the floor, when some kind of tiny humanoid thing is seen running from the other room in the background, darting under a wooden dresser. Is this creature a goblin? What do you think? Have you seen any mythological creatures yourself? Let us know in the comment section down below. Want to watch more videos about amazing creatures, mythological or otherwise? Click on any of the videos you see on your screen. As always, thank you all for watching and I'll see you all next time. Later everybody!